Hello, government students. Good afternoon. It is Thursday the 2nd. I am coming to you live from my kitchen. With my wife in the background. Cooking, I think, spaghetti. Right, hon? Yeah. Okay. Hey, I want to go through the next assignment, which is not due for another week. Uh, the budget problems in Blue Ash. I want to give you some clues towards that. Uh, I will be grading the iCivics assignment tomorrow. Uh, make sure you get that in by tomorrow. I'll grade some in the morning and some in the afternoon. So anyway, let's get to the matters at hand, Blue Ash bu budget problem. So that's what I have here in the background. Bill Brumfield is now the new mayor in Blue Ash. He's a Republican. He is pledged in his election campaign to slash the budget. So you have to take a look at the current budget and you've got to slash it by 3 million. Right here it says 3 million. So not only do you have to do that, and it's up to you where you want to slash it. Um, here's the assignment right here. You've got, you've got to cut 3 million from that, figure it out on another piece of paper. Uh, I, I type it up on a Google Doc. And eventually you're going to share that Google Doc with me. And then you have to explain your reasoning. Why are you cutting that amount? Now, you can take amounts from different departments. You can take some from police, some from fire, some from park and rec, whatever you want to do. It's up to you. It's got to provide a rationale for that. All right. Once you're done with that, you move on to the next set of problems. Bill Brumfield also promised to reduce taxes, not just cut the budget, but reduce revenue or taxes. Revenue is money coming in. So <clears throat> we need to cut taxes or return $3 million back to the community. Um, so you've cut the $3 million. Now, now what's it going to come from in the future? In other words, you've, you've got to return money. Are you, are you, are you going to give people a uh, tax break? on their income taxes, local corporation income tax, local, uh, that, that third bullet right there, local corporate income tax, that is a tax on business profits. So you got to decide where you're going to return the 3 million to. One of these numbers in here is going to be reduced or this idea right here. So uh, the third question, You've got a problem here. We had a lot of snow, obviously not this past winter. I made this part up. And we, in blue ash, salted the streets to get rid of the ice and the snow. And as you may or may not know, salt is really bad for streets. It causes cracks in the streets, which cause potholes. Oof, got a bad pothole problem now in blue ash. And citizen Rick Buckman has spoken up. He's got 500 signatures. They want immediate action on their roads, their overpasses, their bridges. Your mayor Brumfield, you've just cut three million from the budget. Return that three million back to the taxpayers somehow. What are you going to do? You've got to find two million someplace to fix the roads, overpasses, sidewalks, bridges, etc. So. Folks, you, you've got to figure out where you're going to shift the money around. Are you going to raise taxes, which is not what you said you do in your campaign? Are you going to shift money around in the budget? What are you going to do? Lastly, situation number four. Oh, I've got to change that to four. Um, Chip Gilmore is the governor of Ohio. He's got some budget problems, too. You can see the budget breakdown right there, which is real, by the way, a couple years ago. Might not be real right now, but it was real a couple years ago. Um, here's an explanation of each and every one of those categories. Your assignment is you've got to cut eight billion off of that state budget. All right, so you got eight billion somewhere in here. It's a lot of money. It's thirty percent of the budget. Once you cut that, you've got to explain why you're cutting that. So. Type all four of those answers up to the four scenarios on a Word doc and then send that Word doc to me by email. Well, I probably won't contact you tomorrow. I will send a video out on Monday. 